Hey guys, what's going on? Steph here and welcome to day one of Vlogmas. Today is December 1st, 2019. I've done a terrible job of vlogging today because it's already 6.56 p.m. I actually just wanted to start vlogging because Amy and I are currently at my favorite sushi place, Panda Sushi. It's my favorite. If you guys live in the East Bay, you should check it out. Amy's here. Hi guys. Okay, I got a bento box with sashimi and vegetable gyoza. It also comes with, I already drank my soup, but salad. I got double salad instead of rice. California roll, seaweed salad. Amy got chicken teriyaki and tempura. What happened was a three item bento box is $24.95. A two item bento box is $23. So for a, like $2 more, you can get an extra item. Amy went and got two items when for $2 more. Look, all you had to do was speak up. I didn't realize what you were doing you said she said when the waitress was taking order she said can i get a three item bento box i said okay she's getting it and then she changed her no, mind and then i changed it but then then steph said oh that she corrected me towards the to the waitress that's because the waitress was confused the waitress was confused the waitress, was, like, confused. Oh, wait, 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 the waitress was like so do you want one item two items or three items right, but you had the opportunity you i just knew that i was gonna get another order of tempura but then i was like we don't need two orders <laughs> Anyways, um, Patriots are losing, but they're coming back now, which sucks because Amy jinxed it. And so, I can't. So she jinxed them. So now, That's not true. if the Patriots come back and win this game, then it's going to be Amy's fault. I actually, um, you jinxed it. Yeah. Put points against the Patriots because I don't know. They're not that great, and I want Houston to win. They're winning 14 to three right now. I it's didn't middle of the third. Not I. It's gonna be all your fault. This is Amy's favorite temp oh, part of the tempura. Hold oh, and it goes through a ring. This one. Guess what it is? <laughs> it's like a really, <laughs> it's a really thick. Thing. It's a really thick boy. It's a really thick boy. It's asparagus, I think. Not cotton. <laughs> it's <amazing. laughs> Okay guys, they kind of messed up my order. But I want to show you this salmon. Look how delicious this salmon sashimi looks. Look how fatty it is. There's so much fat to this. I'm so excited to eat it. But the tuna was also really good. I don't usually like tuna, but the tuna was good. How's your food? It's good, I'm getting full. No, 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 you can't get full yet. Not yet, breathe, breathe, breathe. I'm breathing. <sighs> Kinda. You sound like you have a stuffy nose. Are you sick? Um, I don't feel sick, but it's possible because a lot of people are. Oh yeah. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Hello, guys. I'm home. Um, I. Gosh. So obviously it's Vlogmas and there's a lot that goes on with Vlogmas, daily vlogging, a lot of advent calendars and so I've been preparing as best as I can for this to happen and I'm still not fully prepared. So I wanted to show you all of the different things I have going on for this year's Vlogmas and then we can do some advent calendars and I think I'm going to leave it at that for now because I'm just, I'm just not fully prepared guys. I'm not fully prepared. My camera is so janky. I can see it like struggling anyways let me show you some of the calendars that i have and we'll open up the first day for some of them and then uh, we'll go from there okay advent calendar number one is this cat advent calendar that chris and soren got for mac um chris actually already opened number one because she was going to give mac one but i was like no you can't you have to wait until until um i i can vlog it and so she's like oh and so she tried to put it back oops <laughs> here's the thing <clears throat> Mac is not the best treats kind of cat, but I'm going to open this up anyways and see if he'll come and eat it. Let me move this out. Mac, come here. What flavor is this? Salmon and seaweed. He's not much of a seaweed or seafood kind of guy. Mac! Seems like a lot of snacks for one cat. Uh-oh. Try it, Mac. Try it. Look. 
Mac, oh. I was worried that was gonna happen, that he wasn't gonna want to eat the cat treat. Dang it. You guys, uh, for those of you who saw my, what was it? My um, birthday, my birthday video. This is the panda that I want on my birthday. It's from We Bear Bears. I love him a lot, he's very cool. Okay, let me show you the other calendars that we have going on this Vlogmas. And just so you guys know, I plan to put a table in my room to do my Vlogmas series, like all my advent calendars, but I didn't get that done today. So you're just gonna see my bed for now. Hey, this is like normal, good old times, isn't it? Okay, so here's the calendars that I got for this Vlogmas. I got kind of a lot, which I accidentally did because I love advent calendars. So these are all my sock calendars. I got a Nickelodeon one. I think this is men's sizes. I got this women's Star Wars one, but it's kind of kawaii-esque, which I'm excited about. And look, this year, I got all these from Target. These were all $15, but if you wait, pretty soon they should go on sale for half off. Um, last year, they were 12 days of socks, and this year, they're 15 days of socks. Uh, I have this women's Harry Potter sock calendar. I also got this women's Harry Potter one. I was interested to see if these were actually the same or if they were different. And I got this cat calendar because this one just seemed like something that I would really like because I love cats and then this is another Harry Potter one so they had three total Harry Potter ones these are all women's um except for I think just the Nickelodeon one is the only men's they didn't really have too many options this year or I just shopped late I also got my Harry Potter Lego advent calendar I was really excited to do um, a Lego advent calendar this year because I haven't done a Lego one yet so that's new to the channel. I also got this bad boy. So I got this a couple days ago. Actually, I got this on Black Friday. This is the Marvel Funko advent calendar, but it's the GameStop exclusive, which is very similar to the regular one, which I actually got from Shumi. But uh, this one has a few different variants that are different. Like, I think it has a gold Iron Man. That's all I really know. You know, there was this other advent calendar that I got, but I just realized that I don't think... I'm going to actually open it for myself because I just don't think it would be a good use of me. I think I just decided just now, literally as I was getting this, that I'm gonna give this to one of my god kids because I think he would make better use of it. But this is a Hot Wheels advent calendar. Um, I don't know too much about this because I saw it at GameStop one day for $20 and I just got it, but I'm sure it's just like one of those things where you get different cars. There's eight cars and accessories. So I think what I'm gonna do is my one of my god kids, uh, Luke, I'm gonna see him in a little bit. I think I'm gonna give him this and then I had originally given Audrey this Disney advent calendar, um, but she actually chose to take the Lego one instead because she loves Legos. So I think what I'll do is I'll save this for Luke and then I'll give Emma, his sister, the Disney one because I think that would be pretty cool. So unfortunately, I thought you guys were gonna see this cool new advent calendar on my channel, but right now you're not. I guess if people really wanna see Hot Wheels, let me know and I can get pick up another one and open it. But I think for now, I, I don't really need Hot Wheels. So I'm going to give this to a kid that will actually appreciate it. This is uh, the Disney one that I was just telling you guys about. This one has a bunch of different little Disney characters on it, and then it has like stickers and accessories and stuff. So I'm going to give this one to Emma. I think she'll like this. So these ones are going to be saved for them. Okay, the last thing we need to do is I pre-ordered two of the Funko advent calendars from Shumi. They just came in like two days ago. So I need to open a few of these Shumi boxes. I usually do an unboxing video, but I'm just gonna crack these open to see if I can pull the advent calendars out and then I'll do an unboxing video for the rest of the stuff. And yes, for those of you who are wondering, this room is still a hot mess, although I have a lot of time off coming up, so I'm really excited to hopefully organize it and clean it and do all the stuff. I was gonna do it today, but I don't know if I'm gonna get to it. So the heater's about to get going and I can hear it. So it's gonna get a little bit loud in here, sorry. But let's go ahead and just, I don't know, there's three different boxes that came from Shumi, so I don't really know which one it's gonna be. But here we 
here's box one. You guys can kind of get a sneak peek of some of the stuff I got. This is all pre-order stuff, to be honest. Okay. So this is definitely not my advent calendar, but here's a sneak preview of some of the uh, pops I got. I don't think they're in here. No, there's just Funko Pops. So let's close that one back up. And then we'll try some of the shimmy boxes that are down there and see if those ones have it. Okay. I don't know why my camera's doing that weird light bar thing. I'm not really quite sure where it's from, but this is box number two. I'm pretty sure that the advent calendars are probably under these pops. So pretend like you don't see these pops for a second. Oh my god, that one's so cool, guys. And we... Oh, I'm so excited. Ooh. Oh gosh, look how good. Yes, I think these are our two advent calendars. I'm going to pull these out. And then I'm going to put these pops back in. So that I can eventually do an unboxing video for these. So, for those of you who are, who are supporting me and my vlog channel, thank you. You get a sneak peek. Sneak peek of what's to come. Yes. I think my camera's broken. What is the weird light bar that's happening here? I can't. I can't tell what's going on. I think my camera's broken and my battery's dying, of course, of course. Okay, I think my camera legitimately might be broken, but that's okay, we're gonna go with it. So basically, what we need to do right now is figure out what advent calendars you wanna open. So like these ones, we'll open one every day, but the sock ones, since there's only 15, I figured we'll, we'll do, I have six sock calendars, maybe we'll do three, each day and then we'll be able to open those all the way up until the end of December. Oh, look at this. Okay, so this one is our 2019 Harry Potter Funko Pocket Pop Advent Calendar. Now this should be technically different than the one from last year, but who knows, we might have to compare. I think it is, because I don't remember there being the Yule Ball ones, but I also don't really remember. It says 2019 limited edition. I'm gonna be angry if we got the same ones. Okay, and this is our regular Funko Marvel calendar. Um, again, these are very similar, so when I once I start opening these, for the ones that are duplicates, I'll probably end up giving those to Jackson, and he can add those to his collection, but I know that there's four, I think four special edition ones that are only in the GameStop box, so I'm excited to open those. So I'm thinking, these are going to be opened every day. And right now I don't have a Pokemon calendar. What do you guys think? Were you guys super into the Pokemon advent calendar? If so, I was thinking I could make a simplified version. Last year I used to put like multiple packs for each day. But I'm thinking maybe this year I just get like a pack a day. Would you guys be into that? Let me know in the comments and I'll definitely, um, I'll definitely make that happen for you guys. I'll go get some Pokemon cards so we can do that. Because I do love that. I would love Pokemon cards. I just didn't, I just didn't plan well enough, guys. That's all that it is. I was a bad planner this year. So what we need to do is figure out on which even days, what calendars we're going to open, and what odd days, what calendars we're going to open. I'm thinking that on even days we do Nickelodeon, maybe that Harry Potter, and cats. <laughs> and then we'll do the two Harry Potter and Star Wars. Or should I just do all Harry Potter? Should I do all Harry Potter together so it's easier for me to remember? And that way we can compare if those are different. And if for some reason we start opening these and they're the same, then we'll um, we'll switch it up or whatever. Let's do that. I think we should do that. Let's do that. I'm gonna do these ones on odd days and Harry Potter on even days because these are kind of a plethora of different types, so they're odd. And these are all the same, so they're even. Well. Max treats are still on the floor, so we're going to pause this for right now, and maybe that's going to have to, I don't know. I don't want to waste it, but I, I'm wondering if Max is actually going to eat the treats. And let's go ahead and open up these sock calendars. So I'm going to put these ones to the side, and like I said, hopefully, I'm going to show you really fast. Hopefully, once I get this all sorted, we're going to be unboxing all of this stuff over there. But I still have to clean it, so that's what we got to work on. So these will be for tomorrow. Stay. That means every day we're going to be opening up seven advent calendars. Oh, this is going to take forever. 
but I think this year I'm just gonna go really quick like last year I think in past years I've gone really slow but now I'm gonna go really quick for those of you guys who didn't know I got myself this like out memory foam bed so I'm not sleeping on an air mattress anymore that's good and it's one that raises up and down so like so it's like a hospital bed is what my friends call it but I love it all right let's do this Okay, it's easier for me to show you guys this way. This is really bothering me that my camera lighting is totally broken right now. I can, ugh, I don't know what it is. I don't know why it's doing that, but whatever. We're gonna go ahead and open the sock calendars first. Um, just because I need scissors. I also got Jackson. Jackson got a Lego advent calendar and I also got him a, mine, a youth Minecraft sock calendar, so Tomorrow when he's not sleeping, since he's sleeping right now, I'll go ahead and see if he can show you guys what socks he got yesterday and what Lego figures he got. He can also show you the Funko Pops that he got for his birthday because he did go to Hot Topic and get Funko Pops. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right. First calendar of 2019. Oh my gosh, this design looks so cool. I'm so excited for this, you guys. <gasps> oh my god. I'm so I love these animations. They look so cool. Look, BB-8 gets two of them. Yes. Okay. Okay. Sorry. 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 Okay. Day number one. How are we doing it? Are we just going to go day number one, two, three, and just, are we going to match the days? I haven't thought of that yet, so we won't think about that. I don't want to rip this because it's so cool. I already ripped it. Okay. <gasps> Oh my god. Oh, yes. Yes. Okay, for day one, we got these green crew socks. Not a huge fan of green, but look at these crew socks. It has the Chewbacca Porg design. Oh, yes. I absolutely love these. I really enjoyed the women's crew socks that I got in my box last year. I've been wearing them to work, so I'm a fan of those. That's very nice. I can put the socks right there. Okay, this one, I think this might be, this might be my favorite one for this year. I really like this calendar a lot. Okay, calendar number two is gonna be this cat calendar. You guys know I love cats. I liked all these cat memes that I could see through the box. And so I'm just gonna go with it. So we're gonna go number one. I may be wrong, but it's highly unlikely. Yeah, that sounds like what Mac thinks in his mind. Okay. These calendars are so hard to open sometimes, I don't understand. Ugh. Okay. Some of these socks might be good for like Chris. I might ask her if she's interested in some of these because this one is like this kind of light bluish like aqua color and it's got hearts and paws. Not really my style, but they're okay. Um, I definitely think that those Star Wars socks are way cooler though. Okay, and then sock calendar number three. This is our Nickelodeon one. I don't know if this is going to be the same as last year's. It looked different to me, but I couldn't really remember. So, and then this is, I think, a men's size. Ow, ow. Um, I think this is a men's size calendar, so... What do we have? Actually, yeah, these are mints because these are ankle socks. So these are Ren and Stimpy ankle socks, but they're just of Stimpy, not Ren. Um, these tend to fit a teeny bit big on me because usually for the men's sizes, I don't know if it'll say what size these are. So these are men's shoe size, what is that, 6 to 12. So it's like a 7.5 in women. So it's, I'm on the lowest end of this for the most part, I'm like an eight or an eight and a half. So I usually can wear a six and a half or seven in youth, um, which is men's size. And so they're like, they fit okay, but sometimes my heel doesn't fit where the sock is. So it's okay, they're okay. Okay, in order to make this go a little bit faster, I'm gonna prep these, but I realize that these all have sleeves. So I just want you guys to know that I'm taking these. <gasps> Ooh, this is so cool. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna take these boxes out of the sleeve so that we could access the advent calendars. Okay, first up is the Marvel one. Here's the thing. I took the sleeves off and now these boxes are legitimately identical and I don't know which one was the one that was from GameStop, so. We're just gonna have to figure it out. Um, this is the 80th anniversary, so this is the comic book version of Marvel. So it's not gonna be it's not gonna be like uh, the MCU. 
Although, I still hope that they give us a Hawkeye. I'm sure they're not going to, but maybe. So we're just going to go through this pretty quickly, and we're going to do number one. Oh, this must be the GameStop one, because this looks like the gold variant of Iron Man. So there he is. That's pretty cool. Um, you know what kind of sucks? This year, I noticed a lot of other YouTubers, they did, like, unboxings of the advent calendars. Like, they did the whole advent calendar, like, in one video, which actually does make a lot of sense because then you know what you're going to get before you buy it. Whoa. But then it kind of spoils all the fun. So this is the GameStop variant. It's a gold Iron Man. This is the regular variant. I will say that I like the regular one better. I like, I tend to like when things have all the colors on them instead of just like one color. This seems a little bit dull to me. It's not boring, I'm going to say, but just kind of dull. So I'm going to say that the 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 regular variant of Iron Man is my favorite out of these two. Look how cute he is. He's super cute. I love him a lot. Next we have our Harry Potter calendar. Ooh, look at this. I don't think there's any um, exclusives of this version. Uh, I got these from Shumi. They were $40. I did have a 20 or 30% off coupon. And then sometimes I'm at uh, GameStop. I actually got the GameStop Marvel one on Black Friday for like $22, but I, they did go on sale a few weeks ago for $20 each, so I guess just be on the lookout. Okay, we got plain Harry. Well, it's Harry in, in dress robes, so I think that's different than the ones that we got last year. I don't know if this is going to be all like Yule ball themed because it's kind of Christmassy. I hope that they have some cool variants this year, like, I wouldn't be mad if they gave us, like, a Cho Chang, or who else? Honestly, even, like, Crab and Goyle, like, I would like that, but I have to look back last year, see what they actually gave us in all of them, but that's day number one, very cool. Okay, I obviously didn't know how this worked, and then I cut the tape on this box, then I slid out the whole tray. I did not realize that... If I just cut the few pieces of tape that were on here, that it actually opens up an advent calendar. So, ooh, almost messed that one up. Oh, this one's fun because the numbers are all over the place. So here's number one. I did not, this is my first Lego advent calendar, so I'm pretty excited. And of course we got Harry. We have a Harry figure, so let's go ahead and build that really quick. He gave me these little brown stick things, which I'm assuming are supposed to be wands. But there's two wands, so I don't know why... Why they would have given me two ones for Harry. I was literally just balancing that camera on my knee, so I don't know how well that looked. But So there's our Harry figure. He's pretty cool. Like I said, it came with this little thing full of wands. So I undid those and I put them in his hand. But I'm not really quite sure why there's two. So maybe he has to share one with somebody. But he's got his Christmas, what do you guys call it? A jumper? Those of you across the pond. He's got his holiday jumper that Ron's mom sent him with the big H on it. So, pretty, pretty cool. All right, so that'll do it for day one of our advent calendars. I'm so sorry, it's so choppy because I, I have to get back into the groove of it all. Um, I, I'm a little bit rusty in the vlogging side of things just because I haven't been vlogging a whole lot. I actually haven't been vlogging at all. For those of you who don't really keep up with my life and also honestly because I haven't been keeping up with you guys very well, I have been so addicted to arcades the past couple months. Like all I've been doing is playing in the arcades. They opened up a Dave and Buster's close by. Um, a lot. It used to be like an hour and a half away and now I can get there in like 10 minutes. And so I've been spending a lot of time at Dave and Buster's as you guys can see. Um, I will be spending a little bit more time there because Jackson has his birthday party coming up in a few days and then Maddie has her birthday party coming up in a few days and her birthday party is going to be at a different arcade called Round One. It's another arcade that I go to where they have claw games that are like Tereba where you have to like it's like just the two prong claws and you have to like try to you know like you try to push things down or move them over. So I'm excited about that. Um, obviously during Christmas Eve we're going to have our hot pot Christmas party at my parents house and I actually have a lot of days off this December. I think I'm taking both weeks off during the break, and that's different because I usually don't. I might work a couple of the days, but I have just kind of a lot of random days off here and there. So I have a lot of plans coming up in the next few months to hopefully 
And I know I've been saying this, but to hopefully continue like organizing my upstairs, um, moving a lot of the stuff from my garage upstairs because I want to move my car into the garage, and then also um, shipping out giveaway boxes and putting together mystery boxes to sell and just like there's so many things I want to do. So I'm really excited about it, and I know you guys are kind of excited about it. I just have been talking about it for like five years now, and I have not done them. So I'm going to make it happen, trust me. And I'm going to do better at these advent calendars. Once I set up the table that I have, I think it's going to go a lot more smooth. But I hope that you guys enjoyed my first episode of Vlogmas. Um, I'm going to have to figure out how to balance kind of the advent calendars and some of the stuff that I do in my life. But I will definitely keep you guys in the loop. I'm hoping to clean my room so that I can just freely vlog and not be worried about showing you guys the hot mess that's in my room because it's such a hot mess. It's so bad. It's really bad. Ooh. But I'm going to figure it out because that's what we do. We figure it out. All right. I hope you guys had an amazing day and I hope you have an amazing day tomorrow or whatever day you're watching this. I hope you guys have an awesome day and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.